Here we go, guys. 2017 Can Am Maverick X3 Black with 32 inch Roctanes beadlock STI HD alloy wheels, number fives. Ugh, scuffed them while I was in Moab. Just bought this, uncrated it. Moto Zoo did a hell of a job putting it together very, very quickly for me. Got out to Moab, ran some tests with it, performed amazing. Got a couple extra light bars on there. Got the front dune bumper on it, orange, red, whatever they want to call it. I will also have the red uh, rock sliders going on right there. I will have the lower door panels on it. And I will also be putting on a aftermarket front locker. That should be pretty awesome. Just got back from Moab, like I said. Rode with a couple guys that have Polaris's. They did very well. Obviously, Polaris is well known for rock crawling ability. This will overtake it. It's just a matter of time. Um, with that front locker, I think it will overtake it. 20 inches of travel. Uh, you did, I did notice I hit, not hit, touched a little bit on the rear here just because of how it bows out there. Um, don't like hitting, but it is what it is. I've got the double decker cooler storage with the swing away rack. This thing is pretty damn awesome. I will not lie. Put that up. Check that out how that looks. Cooler, eight liters, did very, very good. Uh, kept ice all day. Uh, must have sandwiches, dry goods there, ice, beer, waters, whatever you want to take. Then obviously this just comes back down. Lock it in. Then you've got your storage compartment up top for all your shirts, jackets, gloves, goggles, whatever the hell you need, whatever you're doing. Uh, sport roof, must have, very little rattle. Let's fire this up so you can hear how quiet this is also. Turbo in the back, obviously. Party in the front. Look at this suspension coming up. Reminds me of the Yamaha without the Yamaha. So I like that part. Uh, LEDs, here we got the Cadillac looking lights. Perfect touch on this machine. Um, listen to it. Super quiet, super quiet. Take a look, let me know, like it, don't like the video, whatever, I don't really care. 32 inch rock tains on this beast. I will say this, rock crawling, do you see that little shadow right there that did touch just a smidge when you're in a bind, when you're turning, going really slow, crawling, it did touch a little bit, nothing bad. Once you're on the open highway, dunes, whoops, whatever, uh, no touching at all. So I would definitely recommend the 32s. I did measure, this did give it 16 inch of clearance in the middle. That's pretty impressive. The seats rode, oh shit, uh, nine hours, almost two days worth of riding each day. Uh, very comfortable seats. Um, I also have a four seater 2016 and these seats are way nice. They uh, are a lot more comfortable. These are kind of cool, must have. Um, what I love though is I call it the mini Batmobile. Look at that ass end. Looks just like the Batmobile. Anyways, take a look. Let me know what you guys think.